<clears throat> hey guys, welcome back. Hope you had a good day here. It was a really good day here, especially clone wise. Uh, the day with uh, AB Spirit Millionaire. All right, before I get into this, be a little quick little talk about my uh, my up and down relationship with Paco Rabanne One Million, which this smells an awful lot alike. Uh, I've not a hundred percent do, but. 95 98 percent i mean it's pretty damn close um i never liked one million when it first came out and for a solid 10 10 years it was just this super sweet bubblegum scent um it's really only been the last two maybe three years that i've really been starting to like one million um it while well, still sweet it's not as bubblegum sweet as it used to be and it's the same bottle that i have so it's not like it was a reformulation or anything um and it's not that the bottles what they call macerated matured whatever it's not because all the dupes i've smelled of one million and inspired by over the last two or three years i've really liked too so um i think maybe my chemistry changed my skin chemistry it can happen um maybe my just my nose is matured whatever whatever i really like it's not as sweet anymore to me it's more it's got the sweet don't get me wrong i'm saying it's not sweet but it's not a bubblegum sweet anymore it's it's a spicy sweet scent on me now and i get a lot more spices with one million and, and you know cinnamons and, and some leather with one million um this year okay so now we'll get it this is what i wore today hi everybody this is my word day day with um <laughs> Uh, it's obviously a dupe of one million straight up. They don't even try to A B spirit millionaire. I mean, look at it. It's 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 it is what it is. Um uh so yeah, I mean I'm I'm just I'm just I just love the smell of this stuff. Um I went a little heavy with it because of the other Lamani. Um and I think I was just about right. I went three sprays in my moisturizer. One, two, and one on my chest. Put my shirt on, one on my shirt, and one in each crank of the elbow. Um, and that seemed to be the perfect amount for me. Um, I don't think, I think one more spray might have been too much, honestly. And one less spray might have been too little. Um, what I get is this, like I said, sweet spice. And... There's no tobacco listed in it, but I really get a base of tobacco. It could be the type of woods they're using, maybe some patchouli, but I'm getting a tobacco, almost a tobacco vibe from it, especially in the far dry down. Really goes tobacco y. Um, performance, um, great. Especially, I mean, I went online and checked to see how much this is. $17 at Frag Buy. $17 Canadian. So to my American friends, that's like, uh, a cup of Starbucks coffee. If you can afford it, you have a credit card or some way to pay for egg buy for this, go get it. $17. Jesus, son. That's a no-brainer. Performance, like I said, projection was really good for a solid couple hours, like a little more than an arm's length out there. I mean, it's not one million performance. One million is a fucking beast. A motherfucking beast. But, uh, yeah, no, it, it's not, it's it's above average, we'll say that, um, for a solid couple hours, and then it kind of slowly comes in, takes about another hour, starts coming in, um, then I'm getting about five, six more hours of, well, about five hours of a decent bubble, you know, half a foot, and then it kind of comes in the skin and stays, a skin scent for a couple more hours, I mean, a very light skin scent though, like, uh, and that's when it really starts smelling like tobacco to me. So it's a nice tobacco, um, a woody tobacco. And uh, it's the last two or three hours of the scent. But it's also the last time that people really got to get close and dig. Oh, yeah, there it is, you know. Like, so realistically, you could probably reapply after about six hours. Um, you don't have to, though. Um, six hours, six to seven hours gets most people through whatever they're doing. So, Yeah. 
I'm, I'm thinking about buying another bottle, honestly. <laughs> um, I'll probably never wear my one million again because I actually kind of, this doesn't have the cinnamon leather that one million has. And while I love that cinnamon and leather in it, you know me and leather, I'm not the biggest leather fan. So I like this a little better. This has got more of a, the spicing I get more is a, a nutmeg and a clove kind of vibe from this um, with a sweet vanilla. I forgot to mention that vanilla. Gorgeous. Um, like a lot of Lamonis, though, for the first 10 or 5 minutes or so, it kind of smells like perfumer's alcohol. So you got to give it 5 minutes before you make any judgments on it. Uh, but once that perfumer's alcohol burns away, it's it's gorgeous. Um, compliments. I got two compliments wearing it. Um, uh, uh, both... Just, you know, nothing fancy. Oh, that's nice. You know, what are you wearing today? It's nice, you know. Oh, thank you. And I asked at least half a dozen people, a couple girls, a couple guys to smell it. They all said the same thing. Loved it. The men picked up on the spice. That was weird. The, the girls picked up more on the vanilla. I will say that because the one I got the most was, is, oh, it's nice. It's sweet. It's like vanilla. And the guys are like, oh, it's kind of spicy. So women, men's noses pick up different scents anyway, but... Everybody liked it. Of course they did. It's one million. You, who doesn't like one million? I mean, you you maybe want to be a hipster and whatever and be a, the cool cat. Yeah, I'm a cool cat. Hey, I'm a cool cat. But uh, you can't deny it. it. It is what it is. Everybody I know likes one million. And this is actually, to my nose, a little bit better than one million. It doesn't have the same performance, but it's not... Like I said, not by much. I mean, it's it's still a good performer. It's 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 a it's a it's 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 above average. I wouldn't call it great or beast mode, but it's it's above average. And uh, I just like more of the spice. I get more spice from this than I do one million. And I really like that. Um, again, but saying that they're so close, like so close, you, you're not gonna. This is just a slight a tinge, less leathery, more patchouli-like, and a bit more with the nutmeg and clove than the cinnamon. That's that's really the only difference. So, and I think that's a minute difference too, because cinnamon and nutmeg can have kind of the same smell, and they kind of give the same smell in this, but the nutmeg's just a little bit more spicy. So, yeah, that's it, guys. That was a day with. Uh, sorry it took a little longer. I just wanted to talk about one million. Um, my love-hate relationship with it, I guess. My my toxic relationship. Um, so, yeah, guys, that's it. Uh, I'll wear my other Bamani. I got tomorrow. I only got three of them. I forget which one it is now. Uh, it's, the, it's supposed to be the dupe of... Uh, or it is the dupe of uh, Creed Royal Royal Oud. I'll have to look it up. I can't remember. Anyway, guys, peace. Love. Be good to each other.